If you're wondering how to use wild growth hair oil, I'm gonna teach you how to properly use it in this video. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Kozak and I'm back with yet another video. And today I'm gonna to be teaching you guys how to properly use wild growth hair oil. Now, I get multiple, I get constantly just ask questions about how to use wild growth hair oil, whether you should use it during the day or night, how to apply it, etc. And I'm gonna be answering all those questions in this video here. Before we even get started, I need you new guys to go ahead and hit subscribe, turn on the bell, um, leave this video a like, all that good jazz. And if you're interested in growing your hair naturally and effectively, and you're going on your hair journey, and you wanna follow mine as well, be sure to subscribe, turn on post notifications, and do all that good jazz. Now, let's get straight into the video. First thing first, what is wild growth hair oil? Now, wild growth hair oil is a blend of essential oils, essential hair vitamins, nutrients, etc., and just all that blend together, and they put it into this little white container, and they call it they called it wild growth hair oil. Now, the way that this actually grows your hair is by giving your hair basically what it needs. What Wild Growth actually does, it's not like a secret serum that's going to immediately just sprout your hair up and your hair is just gonna grow 10 times as long as it used to. That's not, unfortunately, that's not what Wild Growth really is. That's not what it's really going to do for your hair. What it is gonna do for your hair is help to maximize your potential hair growth. So hair typically grows half an inch to an inch in about a month. So whether your hair is gonna grow a half an inch, whether your hair is gonna grow an inch, or maybe even if your hair just grows a quarter of an inch each month, this is going to help maximize your potential hair growth by giving your hair exactly what it needs, its natural needed nutrients um, each day or each week, um, and just help to maximize overall your hair's potential growth. That is how Wild Growth is going to promote your hair growth. Now, what is in Wild Growth hair oil? Again, a blend of us essential nutrients, oils, etc. Let me read to you guys what is in um, what is some of the ingredients that is in this. So, in this is coconut oil, olive oil, jojoba oil. I think I said that correctly. Rice water, pumpkin seed extract, um, peppermint oil, etc. There's a bunch of different oils and blends of essential nutrients that's in here that's going to help to promote your hair growth. Now onto how to properly use this product. First thing first, once you get a bottle in your hand and you're ready to apply it into your hair, your scalp, whatever, first thing first, you wanna go ahead and shake the bottle. We need to shake it. It says shake well, you need to shake it. This is a this is an inshore or something like that. You gotta shake it up, all right, you know what I'm saying? You gotta, you gotta, you gotta shake it real nice and good and make sure, make sure it's, it's all stirred up in there before you even apply it. Second of all, you're gonna go ahead and apply it directly into your scalp or hair now. I recommend the first thing first before you even put anything else, whether you're gonna condition your hair or whatever. When your hair is freshly um, rinsed or, or washed, or whatever, you're gonna go ahead and apply it directly into your scalp. If you have braids in, I do recommend if you want to maximize your hair growth to use this product when you have braids in. Um, and I have a whole separate video on that. I'll pop it up on the screen here. Um, be sure to check it out at the end of this video. If you have braids, then you're gonna apply that directly into your scalp. Um, whether it's straight backs, which is corner rolls, you're going to apply it in between each and every part, each and every exposed part of your scalp there. And then you're gonna run your fingers through those parts of the scalp and make sure it gets in there. What I like to do is I like to kind of like flare my fingers out um, after you know running it through each of those parts. I like to flare it into the hair. Um, and that, that's usually how I do that. Um, or if you have individuals, whether you have um, two strand twist, whether you have um, braids in, individual braids, you're gonna do the same thing around each and every exposed portion of your scalp and then you're gonna kind of flare it into the hair and that's the best explanation I can give to you if you have braids in. Now, for those people asking if you don't have braids in, how do you apply this product? So this product is for your hair and scalp. So what I did when my hair was shorter is I would apply it straight into my hand, rub it into my hands, make sure it gets into the fingertips, and run it through my hair, and then run my fingers through my scalp and try my best to evenly distribute that throughout my entire scalp. And that's how you would do it if you don't have braids. So if your hair is shorter or whether your hair is really long and you don't feel like you don't have braids in or whatever, 
try to try to get it the best you can into the scalp and make sure you rub that in um, now how often to use this product the easiest way to use this product is simply every other day it says you want to apply this product on the bottle three times out of the week if you do the math if there's seven days in a week and then you divide that by two that's gonna give you like 3.5 so what I did was I just add an extra day and just decided to apply this product every other day now I will tell you there are some days where my hair feels like it's still good and, and good to go and is moisturized from already putting in wild growth so I'll skip a day so I'm, I'll, I'll either say every other day or or every two days that's when you want to apply this product that's the easiest that's the easiest explanation I can give to you guys okay now to answer you guys question on how to apply an other product with wild growth in your hair is very simple so um, what I'll do is I'll apply it directly into my scalp whether I have braids or just like I told you if you don't have braids in you want to try your best to just get into your scalp then if you have a conditioner that you use whether it's as I am or any conditioner that you use for your hair or any curling product or any product that you're gonna put in your hair you put that in after so first wild growth hair oil in the scalp then your conditioner and then what you do is you take a little bit more of wild growth rub it into your hands and then run it through your hair not your scalp and that is going to lock in whatever conditioner or whatever product you're using um, and that's gonna act as a sealant for you um, because it's an oil so it's wild growth whatever product you're using and then wild growth so what I'll say is instead of washing your hair consistently um, just go ahead and rinse your hair out when you feel like you have an overdose or like too much product in your hair whether it's wild growth or a mixture of wild growth and whatever your conditioner is um, you just go ahead and rinse your hair out and then reapply wild growth into your scalp reapply wild growth into your hair lastly um, after you apply this do you have to wear a durag so me mainly I apply the product usually when I'm about to go to sleep I just find it the most convenient I don't have to deal with it um, I'll just put it in throw a do-rag on and then go to sleep um, whether your hair is bigger and you have it in your hair you would um, put it in your hair throw a bonnet on and go to sleep but that's if you're going to apply it when you're going to sleep now you can apply this anytime throughout the day now I do have a video where I use wild growth for a year straight to grow my hair and I had some insane results which is right here be sure to check that video out if you want to go ahead and check it out and if you're new to my channel make sure make sure make sure to go ahead and subscribe and leave this video a like if you're gonna subscribe subscribe with the bell there's no point in subscribing if you're not gonna subscribe with a bell because it's not gonna recommend you my video so make sure you subscribe and hit the bell and make sure to leave this video a like if it was helpful to you at all and yeah I'm Kozak and I'll see you guys in the next video peace